Somewhere out there, if it's not on this planet, it's definitely happening somewhere in the multiverse. In a universe, in a multiverse, on a planet of Earth, or an Earth-like planet where people are dealing with the coronavirus or a virus like it, there is a male, probably a child, it could be a grown man too. I guarantee you there's at least one person in the world that's going through this. Where someone is calling you a punk because you want to wear a mask in public to protect yourself from a virus that could kill you, okay? If no one else in the world gives you permission, I'm giving you permission. Some guy on the internet talking in his basement who says he teaches martial arts part-time and tests software full-time. I give you permission. You are not a punk because you are a man and you want to wear a mask to protect yourself and other people from the coronavirus. It does not make you scared. It doesn't make you weak. You're not, what's, what's the other excuses we like to use? You're not being punked by the white man. None of that. You're being smart and it's your choice at this point. At the time of this video, the CDC has not made it mandatory. The federal government hasn't made it mandatory, but the CDC has strongly recommended that we wear masks in public in order to slow the spread of the coronavirus. So again, if other guys want to be brave and walk around without a mask, they're free to do so and you, you are free to do what you want to do too, okay? And if there's a young lady or not so young lady that you fancy who's got your eye and you want to impress her and she's telling you that you're a punk, that you ain't a real man or whatever other epithets that will get this video kicked off YouTube that uh, she would like to use to insult you, to emasculate you, to humiliate you and to not wearing a coronavirus mask. Ignore her. She is not the one for you because a good woman would want you to wear a coronavirus mask if that's what's gonna make you feel comfortable. And not only protect you, but protect her and protect other people. So in closing this video, once again, you're not a punk because you wanna wear a mask in public. Also, here's a bonus, because somebody did this to me yesterday. When people wanna shame you because you wanna walk around with a bandana on and a face mask on and say, oh man, y'all look like y'all about to rob people. Ignore them. Ha ha ha, it's funny. The only reason why I didn't return it with, let's just say, a politically incorrect gesture where you hold up your fingers, but only one would remain standing. I didn't do that because my son was with me. Even though he's an adult and I don't have to worry about setting an example, I, I still didn't. Because that's what my instincts told me to do. I know that makes me look like not a Christian, but hey. I feel like if you're going to put any shame on me at all, because I'm wearing a mask to protect myself during a pandemic where I could die, there's something wrong with you, not me. So it, it, trust me, I ain't feel bad. I just like mm, self-control, Taekwondo tenant, self-control. Because you never know, I could have nothing to do. You could have ran out there and tried to fight me. And then the next thing you know, I'm spreading and catching coronavirus because I wouldn't keep my fingers down. So in solidarity to the people who may end up being shamed, I already showed you how to make this in another video. I'm gonna do the rest of this video and maybe some other videos while we're under uh, quarantine. I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm not ashamed to get on YouTube and cover my face up. Even though there's no, uh, coronavirus in here. See, I'm not ashamed to go on the internet and wear a mask to protect myself and other people from the coronavirus. So you shouldn't be either. Okay. So if you want to relate this to martial arts, this little bit of mask here, I would say that's from my ninjutsu bag. I don't have a black belt in that. I've just got some exposure to it. So we got a little bit of ninjutsu and our Taekwondo tenets of um, integrity. 
self-control, and courtesy. Courtesy, I talk about courtesy all the time because that's pretty much the main type of tenant that we need to use and can just diffuse a lot of stuff. Courtesy. And from the judo side of the game, this is a mutual welfare benefit. It's a mutual welfare benefit because I'm protecting myself, but more importantly, I'm protecting you from me. Because they've said that this doesn't necessarily stop the virus from getting to you if it's not a medical grade mask, but it can reduce or stop the spread of the virus from you to others. So that's mutual, mutual welfare benefit. Okay? And if you don't believe me, just go on YouTube and search for the story of the man who was a bus driver who died after someone coughed near him. And I, and, and I think it was Detroit. So thanks for watching this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Please share this with people like to talk, talk, talk about the martial arts. And remember, you are not a punk. You know what? Even if they say you're a punk, who cares? If you want to wear a mask, wear a mask. If you don't want to wear a mask, don't wear a mask. But don't come off on people who are wearing it, okay? You respect your lane and let us mask people respect our lane. And that way, we can get through this thing together. And for a bonus, remember, I said in another video, put some sunglasses on to protect your eyes. Peace. Where the pain, where the holes, where the throws, you know what I'm saying?